My highest hope is that <clears throat> probably a couple. One, that from a seed idea, we were able to take a group of people to a foreign land and meet with uh, an individual of a very high state of consciousness and transformation can occur that's now affecting the lives of thousands of people on this planet through individual and group work that's now occurring and projects that are now occurring. And that began with an idea. So I want people to um, think about themselves from the, conscious, from the awareness of if they have an idea, they can share that idea with a small group of people and you never know what's going to happen. I also want people to uh, leave the film with an awareness that all is not lost in the world regardless of how it looks. Because just like in that small gathering, you saw chemicalization, ultimate transformation taking place. That's what's happening on the world scene. You look out, you read the newspaper, you see wars and rumors of wars. You see ecological devastation. You see Darfur, you see Tibet. You see the raping of Africa. You see the Middle East. You see um, Indonesia. You see America. You see so many things going on and people could lose their hope and lose their faith. But when they understand that there's, we're in a process of growth and unfoldment of transformation, and underneath that display of tremendous ego and fear and doubt and worry, and forces that would keep people in fear, doubt and worry with alerts and things of this particular nature, underneath there is a fabric of reality that's unhurtable, that by means of us is seeking to become conscious of itself as us. And that has the final word. That has um, the ultimate say-so in everything that's going on. And that I think, um, whether it's His Holiness and His teachings, Buddhism, whether it's New Thought, Ancient Wisdom, or Ageless Wisdom, whether it's the mystical traditions of all religions, ultimately, you bump into the awareness that love and compassion and peace do have the final word. And that ultimately, it breaks into our awareness with some work, with some participation, and some intention, some visioning. But don't be afraid of what you see in the world. Just find your place in the world to share your gifts, your talents, your capacities. Find where you can activate your potential so that you do not die wondering if the world could be better. No. You don't die until you give your gift. You don't die, you don't let go of your body until you have shared the song that you're supposed to sing. Until you express the dignity and the beauty and the authenticity and the intelligence that is within you. I want people to leave the film understanding that they can make a difference. And not to be in dismay. Oh, the ego, oh, bad people, oh, negativity. No. What can you do? to make a difference, because it does make a difference. Every, what appears to be little thing, makes a big difference. I want them to leave with that.